In this module, we shall discuss necessary and sufficient condition when factor group is an abelian group. Let's state the theorem. If N is a normal subgroup of G, G is a group, then G over N, the factor group is a billion if and only if C is subgroup of N. Here C is the set of all commutators of the form say A, B, A inverse, B inverse. And A, B are arbitrary elements of G. And we have already proved in previous modules C is the subgroup of G. And moreover, we have proved that C is the normal subgroup of G. Let's prove this theorem. If N is normal subgroup of G and G over N is abelian, then we want to show that uh, G over, uh, then we want to show that the commutator group C, the commutator subgroup C is the subgroup of N. Uh, we are proving uh, necessary and sufficient condition in this theorem and then we shall establish the converse statement that is we shall assume C is the subgroup of the normal group N implies uh, implies uh, G over N is commutative. Now let's take the product A inverse N into B inverse N and we can write the elements in the factor group in this form because A, B, R belongs to G and G is a group. Their inverses are also belonging to G. So we are making two classes with uh, first class is uh, from, uh, making from uh, A inverse and second which is belonging to G and second class is making from B inverse which is also belonging to G. So we have uh, uh, the product in G over N A inverse N B inverse N which is equal to B inverse N A inverse N because we are assuming that G over N is abelian. So its element would compute, would uh, commute, its element would commute. That is, we can write uh, this equation as A, B, A inverse, B inverse N equal to N. और जैसा कि आपको मालूम है एन नॉर्मल सबग्रुप है और हम मल्टीप्लिकेशन कर सकते हैं ए इनवर्स एन बी इनवर्स एन की मल्टीप्लिकेशन क्या आएगी हमारे पास ए इनवर्स बी इनवर्स एन और इसी तरह बी इनवर्स एन इनटू ए इनवर्स एन की मल्टीप्लिकेशन बी इनवर्स ए इनवर्स एन आ जाएगी और जब आप लेफ्ट हैंड साइड पर बी से मल्टीप्लाई करेंगे दोनों साइड्स को तो या राइट हैंड साइड पर आप ए बी से मल्टीप्लाई करते हैं दोनों साइड्स को तो हमारे पास वी आर मल्टीप्लाइंग बाय ए बी ऑन बोथ साइड्स एट लेफ्ट हैंड साइड ऑफ दिस इक्वेशन वी शैल गेट एट द लेफ्ट हैंड साइड इक्वल टू एन एंड राइट हैंड साइड इक्वल टू a b a inverse b inverse n so a b a inverse b inverse belongs to capital n aur jaisa ki aapko maloom hai a b a inverse b inverse to commutator hai aur wo set of all commutators ko belong karega matlab c ko belong karega jo ke hamare paas commutator subgroup hai g ka तो हाँ इसका ये मतलब हो गया कि इट आल्सो बिलोंग्स टू सी सो सी इज द सब ग्रुप ऑफ एन बिकॉज 
سی کا ایک آربیٹری ایلیمنٹ جس کو ہم اے بی اے انورس بی انورس کموٹیٹر کی فارم میں لکھ رہے ہیں وہ اینڈ کو بھی بلونگ کر رہا ہے تو اٹ مینس ڈیٹ سی سیٹ آف آل کموٹیٹرس از آ سب گروپ آف اینڈ آلسو نو وی شیل پروو دا کنورس اسٹیٹمنٹ فائنلی اف سی از دا سب گروپ آف اینڈ سی از دا سیٹ آف آل کموٹیٹرس فارم آ سب گروپ آف اینڈ دین وی وانٹ ٹو شو ڈیٹ جی اوور اینڈ از ابیلین سو وی شیل پک ٹو آربیٹری ایلیمنٹس آف جی اوور اینڈ A and B are arbitrary elements of the group G and we shall uh, obtain A and into B and equal to A, B and because N is the normal subgroup of G therefore coset multiplication is defined and uh, if we write A, B as B inverse A inverse B, A and b inverse a inverse because b inverse a inverse b a belongs to c because this is the commutator and c is the subgroup of n so it means that jab aap n ke andar se hi koi element pick karenge to aapke paas n hi aayega to by Uh, by clear property of uh, uh, the identity element because uh, n hamare paas identity element hai aur uh, factor group hamare paas g over n hai aur g over n ke identity kyunki agar hum n class ke andar se koi bhi element pick karenge to uh, jab us element se hum apni n class ko multiply karenge to same n class hi hamare paas aayegi n hi aayega تو اس لیے بی انورس اے انورس بی اے این کو وی کین رائٹ این ایکول ٹو بی انورس اے انورس بی اے این کوئی بھی کموٹیٹر لے لیں اس کو این سے ملٹی پلائی کریں کیونکہ سی از دا سب گروپ آف این تو آپ کے پاس این سے ملٹی پلائی کریں گے تو این ہی آئے گا سو ان دس وے نو وی وانٹ ٹو اے بی وی آر ٹیکنگ ہیئر ان دس اکویشن اے بی ایز اٹ از اینڈ now we multiply we are using the associative property and we are moving uh, we are um, uh, multiplying a b with b inverse a inverse and b a n this is equal to and we know that b into b inverse is the identity element b belongs to g its inverse also belongs to g and uh, identity element because g is a group uh, and uh, in this manner we shall get Uh, a b b inverse a inverse an identity element e and when e multiply by b a we shall get b a n because n is the uh, subgroup uh, n is the normal subgroup of g and g over uh, therefore coset multiplication is well defined and we shall obtain b n into a n so it means that it implies that g over n is commutative